and welcome back to Silver City. In today's video, I'm going to review in depth the 2019 Truth Coin series, starting with the first release, The Roaring Lion. Initially an SD Bullion exclusive, beginning in 2018, the Truth Coin series became an instant success and currently has three complete sets released, and the second coin in the fourth set is scheduled for release soon. Interesting. The coins seem to be released in reverse order from the intended set design. The Lion of Judah, or Roaring Lion, is the first release of the set. However, it bears the second half of the truth. What is the truth, you ask? Each coin bears half of a two-part scripture, with the Tree of Life coin bearing the first half of the truth, and the Lion bearing the second. The scriptures are micro-engraved and embedded within the image itself. You can kind of see it up there in the lion's mane. I'll try and do a little bit better of a zoom in here shortly. On the tree of life, get that back on there. To date, the design remains unchanged and the scripture is located on the lowermost left side branch of the tree with the Hebrew letters yod He vav He appearing below the roots of the tree memorializing the tree as the one who gives true life. The Roaring Lion coin, however, the design changed in 2020. The previous design depicts a majestic lion standing in a powerful stance of defense or protection, with the micro-inscription appearing there in the flowing mane of the lion. Again, I'll show it better in a moment. The Hebrew letters Aleph and Tav appear between the lion's feet, denoting him as the Lion of Judah, the Alpha and the Omega. Put that back momentarily there. These coins are Nui backed and have limited mintages of 50,000 each. They are minted in the United States by the prestigious Sunshine Mint. The mintage of 50,000 is moderate but still relatively low. These coins have quickly become favorites of followers of Yeshua, collectors, and other fans of New A coins. I myself am a fan of New A coins. They are exquisite and beautiful, and one of my favorites. Being backed by New A, they naturally bear the effigy of the Queen, Old Betty, and list the face value as $2.00. Striking radial lines emanate from an unseen point behind the queen, providing a nice textured background, rather than that smooth mirrored finish you see on a lot of coins, which can be nice, albeit that can be very nice on some pieces. I actually really like frosted backgrounds or backgrounds with these radial lines or some other kind of design. The Tree of Life, part one of the set, depicts the Tree of Life as a young almond tree, blossoming with new shoots in the early spring. The 2019 set bears the scripture John 14, with the tree bearing the first half proclaiming proudly, I am the way, the truth, and the life. Let's see if I can get in here any better on that. And see if we can zoom this any better here. I know I can do it if I get the right lighting and the right distance, so bear with me here.
there. That's not too bad. You can see, I am the way, the truth, and the life. Sorry, I can't hold it much stiller than this. Okay, put that back here. The Roaring Lion, part two of the set. The stunning obverse depicts a majestic roaring lion in the attack stance. His front left paw and forearm stretched out while he erupts in a dominant roar, proclaiming the second half of the scripture. No one comes to the Father except through me. Swirl radial lines emanate from the center of this coin, giving this a stunning design as well. The 2021 series is currently live with the Lion being released a few months ago. I'm sure a lot of you have seen that. Well, a lot of you probably even have it. Uh, it features a completely redesigned obverse. Awaiting the release of the 2021 Tree of Life, it is unknown at this time if there has been a redesign on that as well. I personally cannot wait for it to drop as I do have the 2021 Lion. And I will make a quick cameo appearance of that. If you haven't seen it, there's the new design for the 2021 Lion. Uh, let's see. Uh, I can't wait for it to drop. I have the lion, like I was saying, and I need to make the set. I also need the 2020 lion so I can do a full review on that set as well as both of the 2018s. Premium at launch of the 2021 lion were around $3 over spot, which is amazing. The older ones seem to hang out around $15 over spot, and I got one of mine on sale. So I paid uh, I believe $8 over spot for that one, and I waited for that one to come on sale, and it never did. So I think it was 16 over spot for that one. But uh, the 18s are sold out and only available on the secondary market, so yeah, I keep my eyes open for a deal on those. Hopefully I can pick one up from the community. Um, a little bit more on these. Got uh, one troy ounce, four nines fine silver. I believe I showed you the scripture on the tree. Let's see if I can get you a good scripture on the lion here. Bump back out to one and then zoom in all the way to five. If I can hold this still. Ooh, there we go. No one comes to the Father except through me. Sorry, it's jumping around. I can't hold it any stiller than that. But yeah. Beautiful coins. Stunning. Nice, uh, nice security features with the radial lines front and back. This is the 2019 set. The full review. New A backed, $2 face value, Queen Elizabeth II, Ian Rank Broadley's rendition of the Queen. Both coins in 4.9 fine silver, 1 troy ounce. They did make 5 ounce high relief versions of these, and I believe those were limited to a 1,000 mintage each with the serial number on the side so there's that so yeah there's uh there's the 2019 set like i was saying i've got the 2021 lion and the 2020 tree so i've got half of each of those two sets and need to complete those 
All right, folks, I hope you've enjoyed this full review of the 2019 Truth Coin series, $2 face value new A coins minted in 49 fine silver, one troy ounce each. Uh, they also did one ounce gold versions of these sets. Um, gold being way out of my price range, I never looked at the details. I think the mintage was way lower, I want to say probably... Uh, hundred maybe fifteen hundred like I said I didn't look at the details so I don't know honestly um, hopefully one day I'll be able to review gold anyway I'd like to thank you all for taking the time to watch this review if you enjoyed it please hit that thumbs up feel free to comment below and if you're new to the channel go ahead and hit that red subscribe button down there and set the bell to all so you'll never miss any of my amazing content Okay, that was a bit much, but seriously, subscribe if you like my content. I'm on a push for 100. Thank you again. Good night. God bless. And I'll leave you with Scrooge McDuck. Quack, quack.